Tov. Good morning. We continue with our three-minute daily dose of Torah, looking at chapter 30 of Devarim, Parshat Nitzavim. And yesterday we we noted the you know constant use and reuse of the of the shin vait root, which has to do with returning and um, God returning physically the children of Israel to with the land of Israel, God returning or going back, we returning as well. Um, so it's, it's hard not to uh, to to catch to catch. That the Torah is inter is interplaying all of these terms, and what we refer to as return and repentance, they're all happening here in both directions: God to the Jews, Jews to God. And there seems to be, um, as we noted, a challenge in reading the verses because it says it's hard to tell when you have um, like the word vishavta. Is that a um, descriptive? of what will happen in the future, a prophetic statement, or is it a tzivoy, is it a command form? They both will be the same structure, and is there a, is there a commandment that's happening here to return? Or simply, well, a description of what will happen. And that's where we pick up Pasuk Yud Aleph. Ki ha-mitzvah hazot asher nochi mitzavacha hayom because this commandment, which I command you today, it is not too um, too awesome for you, nor is it too uh, distant for you. It's not in the heavens. They mourn me. We'll say who's going to go up there and to get it for us and, and 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 somehow teach it to us and have us understand it. It's on the opposite side of the ocean. They mourn me. We'll say who's going to go over there and get it for us. It's not so far away from you. The matter is indeed quite close to you in your mouth and in your heart to carry it out. So says the Ramban in reading this text. Uh, hold a second, hold a second. <laughs> But when we refer to this mitzvah, we're referring to teshuva, that which has been described in the previous uh, ten verses. When we have those words that say, and, and, and you will, and you will um, bring it to your heart, and you will return to God. You shouldn't have said it only as, as, uh, as, as a description, but as the commandment, mitzvah she it's about, tanalat It is a commandment that God is commanding us to do so, and it's just given to us, but lashon benoni, in the, in, in the power of middle ground, is, it doesn't sound exactly clearly as a command. Lirimoz b'haptacha kiatina debar lehiyot kain, to be a hint that is a, as a promise that this will indeed be the case. So that's what we have here, the Ramban's teaching, that this is a, the, this mitzvah refers to the mitzvah of teshuva, and that's an interesting thing, my friends. I want you to think about the, uh, the conceptually, should there be a mitzvah of teshuva or not? That's what I'm, the point of silence is here on the recording. That's what I want you to think about and have an opinion about when we gather again tomorrow. Wishing you all a great day.